lovely baddies <laughs> no. what's up y'all welcome back to my channel i know i've been gone for a while but we just officially moved to las vegas i am now located in las vegas in nevada so it's a lot of new updates and a lot of new stuff going around so just to give you guys a quick little overview i officially started nail tech school <laughs> oh my god like okay but i'm on week around two I think um, I'm about to start week three on Monday. I'll get into that into a why I decided to go to nail school and what's in my kit video that is coming this Sunday. All right, stay tuned for that. So I was really, I really loved creating this video for you guys. I thought it was really fun. I really am in love with my nail studio, my nail little area. So if you guys wanna see how I created this, keep on watching. Alright my lovely baddies, this is the front of my studio section and sorry for the lighting but yeah. Um, I have this window right here and I think I'm gonna get a curtain because I'm not used to having all this light so my ring lights and my studio lights are not, they, they're not working with this bright sun. But yes, so these are my letters, you know, it says Camille Dior and I got these from Hobby Lobby, they were $3.99. Oh my god, y'all. They were so, so expensive, but so worth it. And I only say they were expensive because look how many letters I have. Add that up. But it's okay. Um, my lights and my um, ivy or whatever, vines, whatever you want to call them, I got those from Amazon. They actually came together. These are two packs. These are one pack of lights and two packs of the ivy leaves um it actually turned out exactly how i wanted so i was not mad at all and then you guys see my butterflies i have up here and you know same little butterfly these are actually from amazon as well majority of my items are from amazon and they were only three dollars and i think the ivies were like eight or nine dollars a piece but yeah definitely worth it i really love them the lights have different settings i just like this setting if you guys are wondering what that water sound is, it is definitely um, this um, waterfall, water fountain I got from uh, uh, freaking Five and Below. <laughs> I'm going to turn it off shortly, but I just wanted, you know, a peaceful area. Okay, so moving on to the right side of my desk, I have my essentials in this turnstile. I got this from Hobby Lobby. It was like $6 or $7. And I also got this uh, pump. Uh, like it was empty but I put hand sanitizer in it and I need to label that but I got this from Hobby Lobby and I have um, my acetone in here and I have some alcohol I got these from the dollar store um, the containers from the dollar store Dollar Tree I have this milk and honey cuticle oil I just ordered this and I haven't tried it yet but I'm super excited I was looking for some cuticle oil because I haven't had time to make my own yet so I was like I need something real quick I have 
this um, nail glue. This is my McCart nail glue, but the bottle got, I lost the top or something, so I just put it in there, and it's in a clear container, and I just uh, put a brush with it, but I'm just trying to preserve it so I can buy some more. I also have some alcohol in a spray bottle for easy access. I have my nail charms in here. These are the nail charms that I will be selling on my website when um, it does launch in this upcoming week. Um, I have my nail charms, so when I do actually do some sets with them, this is what I use. Uh, I have, I think I already went over this. I have all of my rhinestone gems in here. I have my big gems and then my, you know, shapes and little essentials and then the little beads and then all of my like um, hoop charms, I guess, like ring charms that go around, like my hanging nail charms, they are in the bottom of that. Uh, I also have my sanding bands and my e-file tools in here and I have the bits in here and all that good stuff. And then we're moving on to this beautiful, beautiful like brush holder I got off of Amazon as well. I actually love this thing because it fits all of my brushes in here. And at first I was a little spectacle because it is clear on the inside a little bit. I didn't like that, but it's okay. Also with this, I put cotton at the bottom of it because I didn't want my implements to be like, you know, I didn't want them to get like broken or anything at the bottom of that. I also got this brush off of Amazon. I really freaking love this brush. I couldn't decide which color I wanted. So I got the orange because I know a lot of people do have this brush, but you know, I want to be a little different, you know. So right here I have a matte, a diamond matte I got off of Amazon. And on top of it, I have this glass plate. And I actually uh, got this idea from Vanity Val. Uh, I needed something to stop me from messing up my tables all the time. And this was perfect. So shout out to her. Make sure y'all go subscribe if y'all haven't. Moving over here, I have this lamp. If you guys can see, it's on though. But um, I bought this amp off this amp off Amazon. The lamp, I told y'all, everything in my hauls are normally from Amazon. But uh, I have this lamp. It has three different settings on it. And then it has a uh, nighttime mode. And it just shows the sides or something. I don't know. I'm just showing you guys the lamp because it's pretty cool. And you never know what you might need. Um, I will put all of the things that I bought in a list and I will post it in the description box. So just click on the list and it'll take you directly to Amazon. So um, on top of my lamp is my dappin dishes. These are super small. I'm definitely gonna have to order some more, but this was just for now, you know, and I, I didn't read the reviews on those exactly, but they were $5. So, you know, they're better than this. I hate these dappin dishes. I use these for my glues, like any dappin' dishes like this I have. I put my nail glues in there. It holds them, especially, you know, right here where I know that I'm going to need them. Right here I have my BT Art Box um, e-file. I did have to order a new one because mine did break, but we're not even going to get into that. This is an air purifier. It has three settings, and I decided to get this because... You know, doing mon like doing acrylic sets and monomers, that smell is overpowering. So I got this to see if it'll help because honestly, like just opening the window and stuff does not work. And you're not supposed to do that because it just pushes all the fumes to the bottom of the, the uh, ground. Like I can't even, I'm not even gonna get into it, but yeah, I told you guys, I got that from five and below that little faucet thing right there. Moving on. We are in my little office. I did want to combine my office and my nail space because this is where I'm always at and might as well. So I'm gonna sit down now, you guys. Oh, my UV lamp is under here. And then on the like, little shelves down here, I just have like some acetone over here. I need to pick that up. <laughs> some acetone, some alcohol. And then I have these bowls and this brush. I got the bowls from Dollar Tree. I'm gonna use these to do my soak offs in and the brush, you know, um, when I have to clean the nail. Especially when I'm doing acrylics, if I need to like clean, cleanse my nail, I don't have to get up and go to the sink. I can just do it right there. I also got these from Dollar Tree, these containers with the lid. I love these. I have non, like non lint. 
wipes in there, lint-free wipes. I have some cotton in there and then, well, some cotton balls. And then I have some Q-tips because I definitely always use those. Those are something, some things that are frequently used. So over here, down here is a box that is part of my nail haul. Uh, that's going to be the next video, but I just got it today. So that's why I just laid it over here. You guys, this is my office area, like I said. So my laptop, if you guys are not subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button for me. I have my business license. Behind my laptop, I have this cute LED light I got from Five and Below. And it says goals. I'm trying to turn it on. You guys will get a better, like like view of things at nighttime so when i record a nighttime video i'll make sure i give you guys another tour right quick i got this planner from hobby lobby it was a dollar 99 dollar 95 um i haven't did anything yet because i just set everything this beautiful painting back here that i know y'all probably been waiting to see where i got it from my friend Bree made this and for my birthday she gave it to me as a birthday gift so I'm going to go ahead and put her handle, her tag, her business page, all that. So you guys can definitely check her out. Amazing, amazing artist. My girls. All of my friends got talents, period. Okay, so over here, I have my HP MV photo printer. This is where I make my business cards. I make um, my thank you letters. Anything that you guys have heard me talk about or made, I made it with this printer. This is a photo ink jet. And then up here at the top, this is my school laptop. So I have my personal, which is a Mac. Y'all know I'm iPhone gang all day. And then I have my uh, student laptop because I still do school stuff over here. So like I said, these are the little cubbies down here. Um, my, <laughs> over there, that's my recording lamp. I never put it back up because the next video I'm about to do, I have to, yeah. It, we ain't gonna go there but um down here i have my mic and i have uh my payment things i never used because i never sold in person before but my square reader and my paypal pay here thing i do plan on using them eventually just haven't yet so we are here on the wall so you guys can get a little nice little view area thing you feel me so this cart first of all i got off michael's i expected it to be a tad bit bigger so i'm a tad bit disappointed but it is okay um these are not all my nail polishes these are a good chunk of them though you guys know there's beetles up there and uh, all that and um, a cart you guys have seen me use all of these almost but these are what i have currently i do want to do a haul another big nail haul get some more nail polishes um, I actually do have some products coming in, but they got shipped to Virginia instead of Nevada. So I have to wait till they get here, but they will replace this entire rack. I do have another one of these racks. I got this off of Amazon. It's a five tier rack. It is very flimsy. Um, and it was a little hard to maneuver. Like if you see like the screw is moving, I do not recommend, but it is really nice and it gets the job done. Over here, you guys, these are my acrylics. These are my acrylic collection. This is all the powders that I have that I will be selling on my website. I do plan on having it open by this week. Um, also behind it is my nail um, foils. And the reason why, I'll go into why I changed my brand and all that later, but we're not even going to talk about it. But Cure by Camille, if you guys did not know, if you guys have not seen my Instagram, make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. That's where you're going to see me the most, as well as TikTok. So you guys can keep up with me. I promise you when I do giveaways or I make announcements or things go on sale or I do anything important, you have to follow me on social media so you guys can be aware. And if you want me to respond quickly, Instagram. Uh, so this little word letter board I got from the Dollar Dollar General, not Dollar General, Dollar Tree. And, and you know, it says that don't stop dreaming, love. But I'm a little mad because that's not what I wanted to say. But there was only like... They had double D's and double S's and double T's, but the the letters I needed, they didn't have doubles of. So I should have knew better. I, I should have knew better. But I'm getting a light board soon, so I'm not worried about that. Ooh, so like to say, back here behind this, I actually have my disinfectant wipes that I use all the time. Um, just to have them on my desk area and easy, easily accessible yeah big words all right so to go in the drawers they are a little messy but right here i have uh, my buffers and files 
and I'm about to change this because I got new buffers and files in the mail, so I'm excited about that. My nail glues, um, when I make my acrylics, I use, you know, my measuring sticks or whatever. I got extra Q-tips. These are actually craft gloves that I got from Walmart. It's a pair of three. So I got three. I have like nine pairs because I bought a couple packs. And uh, I just want to see how they work versus, you know, using like other gloves. And honestly, I couldn't find any gloves that were not expensive right now. I'm not dealing with it. But um, yeah, so I have my alcohol wipes in here. It's a lot of them. They're back here too. I went and got some more little clippers just to have some extra ones because mine keep disappearing. My boyfriend's always taking them. So in here, I just have my my um, my foil. I don't even know why it's in the drawer by itself, but my golden foil. And then I have this. These are the containers. I got these from the 99 cent store. I don't know what I was gonna. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what I was gonna put in these, but uh, they're the ones that you've seen with my e-file bits and my charms and my uh rhinestones in it so i'm just gonna close this i think i'm gonna use this drawer for all uh, my pr um stuff that i get i actually have some pr products that i'm shouting out in the next video so definitely make sure you look at that video this is like where all my personal nail stuff is um it's not all of it but it's a good amount and then i have these rings i'm actually wearing some of them i got these from i think it's called or or um arula or area i don't know but uh this is the card it was like an overseas company and they had sent me these they messaged me on instagram these are like costume jewelry um you guys will see uh, like I have on a necklace, a bracelet, and then some more rings. If you guys like my nails, let me know, you guys. You know, these little fire, these little old. But I definitely made my first TikTok about these, I think. So definitely go look at them, please. Thank you. Follow me on TikTok. I am Camille Dior. Y'all, let's get it popping. So um, the next drawer is just my display. Um my display nails and uh i got these off of amazon these are two separate bags i think these are like 100 and these are 200 and i'm gonna swatch all my colors and all of my acrylic soon so you guys can see that these are all my nail tips nail tips full nail tips all of them are mixed in here i have to organize them uh but i will get around to it eventually moving on down here these are like my old recycled nail bins or whatever i like to keep them because you know you can never you can always organize stuff and make new stuff out of stuff like this like you know you might have some new foils that just come in packaging that you might need to put somewhere but anyway uh i have regular like acrylic paint i just bought i want to try to do some nail designs with acrylic paint to see how they go and then these are just my acrylic jars they are a there oh, i can't talk today they are a different size than these they're a little bit more flatter but i think that'll be better to apply acrylic because it's kind of hard to get in those jars so okay so in this drawer i have my full nail tips and like my acrylic tips and this bottle of lotion or this bottle for lotion that i have that i have not filled up yet but these are the tips i use for my personal self um no one else and then i'm gonna move on to my next door my next door is empty yee like this is empty but um these are all my glitters and all of my chrome powders this is empty because i could not take everything with me to nevada like i couldn't bring everything with me and a lot of my stuff had to get thrown away or i gave it away i gave a lot away i gave a lot of things away to my cousin because she wanted to start doing nails and uh, start a business of her own so all of my business essential stuff and all that stuff i gave to her um these are just you know nail charms i don't even really use any of these i probably use like the butterflies and like yeah but all that's in there i'm gonna flood my glitter collection soon so i'm not worried one thing about these drawers michael we need to talk about like michael's what is going on here there we go just off the rails a little bit so the next door is my decals my foils and my uh pom-poms i'm debating on selling these 
uh, I really love testing products out before I, you know, open my stuff to the public. I do have a wholesaler for everything that I sell, you guys. I do get from a actual wholesaler. Not everything comes from Amazon. <laughs> I promise you. But um, these are my transfer foils, and these are, you know, my foils and all of my decals are in here these are some demon slayer decals oh my goodness the light the light oh you guys can't even see wtf um yeah but these are some decals i made some demon slayer ones i tried making my own decals you guys i don't know if it was a hit or miss yet because i haven't tried them but yeah i made those this store is empty yeet <laughs> I have some more nails in here. These are for my press on nails. And then this is another PR box from BT Art Box. I couldn't even do a full tutorial on that, but I did make a TikTok um, with using some stuff out of that kit and super bomb. The nails came out super bomb, but <laughs> I only used some things. The last drawer on here is my disinfectant and like extra stuff and like all the stuff to, you know, all my health stuff i need to put my first aid kit in here but this is my implement sanitizer uh but i don't i don't know what you call this box <laughs> um my barber side and stuff hasn't got here yet so this is gonna stay in here plus i don't do anybody else's nails but myself so i can just lightly sanitize it and use some disinfective wipes i have specifically for that i have some sanitization pouches for when i actually do start taking clients and you know just to practice and actually use them to make sure that my implements are being uh safely you know guarded because <laughs> Well, not safely guarded, but safely protected because you do not want to be getting sick out here or getting anybody any type of infections or none of that. Even if it's just you, you still want to make sure because you can give yourself a infection. Like if you do not clean your implements, you can cause damage to yourself. So very, be very careful about that. I have this Dawn hand soap, antibacterial hand soap. I'm going to use this for my soap calls. I'm going to use it for... Whatever I need hand soap for, you know? Uh, and then I wanted to wait for these, but these are my lint-free nail wipes. I got, this came in a three pack and I got these off of Amazon. You guys will see these in my next video. But I, those are the ones I had in my little jar. So that is pretty much everything, you guys. We've been through the entire nail table, you know, cause we got goals, you feel me? All right, my lovelies, that completes my nail tour. I feel like we was on MTV Cribs, you feel me? Like, I just felt like I just showed y'all my old crib. Like, no, <laughs> but for real, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed my nail room as much as I did. If you didn't, I'm sorry you're so bitter. Like, what are you on? Join the fam. But uh, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. I'm back like nothing ever happens. I'll see you guys in my next video.